Hello everybody, welcome back. Hope y'all are having a fantastic day. Today we are headed out to thrift. So um, I've recently gotten into thrifting a lot. I have some really good friends that go pretty much every day and they always seem to find really cool things. And so I've gotten into thrifting and I've been having a lot of fun doing it. I don't really go every weekend and definitely not every day. <laughs> but today I took my sister with me and we went to Deseret Industries. Deseret Industries is owned by the members of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. And they have like just a huge donation thing that they do. Like everybody just brings in all their stuff. And then they sell it for like super cheap prices. And you can get like name brand stuff like Patagonia and um, like L.O. Bean and things like that. So you can get really, really nice expensive things for like, what, a 20th of the price? But anyway, today we're gonna have a lot of fun. Um, I realize now that I didn't get a whole lot of footage inside the store. <laughs> so um, you're just gonna see like probably two clips, like one of the racks and the other of my sister. But um, let's go there and then I'll show you guys what I found. <laughs> So we just made it to DI. I have my sister with me <laughs> and we're going to go in and we're going to try and find some really cool finds today. Um, it's kind of vlogging style again. Um, please let me know down in the comments if you like the vlogging style because I feel like it's kind of weird and it's hard for me and I'm standing sitting in the parking lot here. Like I'm scared that people are going to be watching me and things like that. But let's go in and let's get some really cool finds and then we'll have a try on session after we get through with this. So yay! <laughs> Love, Kusa, made in the Asa. <laughs> I feel like sometimes I'm not the best at thrifting because I just kind of like go through the racks and see what I like. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed that footage of my sister being goofy because we were having way too much fun. We were laughing so hard. Um, my, when my sister and I get together, our humor is like insane. But anyway, so I have some really... <sighs> I'm so excited. I found three pairs of Wrangler jeans. I don't know um, if this is just becoming like a style icon this year, but I found Wrangler jeans. Okay, also first, I just wanna show you like these cute, adorable shoes that I found. I've been looking for a pair like this. Um, I was just gonna buy them from a boutique, but they're like super nice and barely worn and I'm in love with them. So I'm really glad I got these. And then I just got a shirt for my husband because I never know what he likes. And so sometimes I just buy things that I think he might like and that I think look good on him and then just go from there. So that that's my husband's. But I got three pairs of Wrangler, Wrangler, Wrang, Wrangler jeans. <laughs> and I'm not going to try anything on today. I'm going to try to do a little something different with this video and make it more concise. So in the comments below, please let me know if you like videos that are more concise. But anyway... I found a black pair of Wrangler jeans, y'all. And these are so freaking cute. So like Wrangler jeans are very like mom style-ish. Um, they're kind of thicker, like especially around like your hips and your thighs and they just kind of like go straight down. But I think they're so freaking cute. And when I see like other people styling them, I'm like, I kind of want to do that too. So I have a black pair and then I got this pair this more like uh, dark denim. This is like a working pair. And I know this is gonna sound super weird, but my dad wears Wrangler jeans. My dad, who's in his 50s, wears um, Wrangler jeans. So my parents are gonna laugh at me when they find out that I wear Wrangler jeans, but I got this pair of blue ones. And then I got this pair that's a little more like mom stylish. And y'all, these are, excuse you. Anyway, these are vintage 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 wrangler jeans you want to know how i know because this label right here literally like no wrangler jean has this ever i have never seen a wrangler jean have this so these are like old and i'm so proud of myself um but these are so cute i thought they were absolutely adorable and i think it's kind of an interesting style to have like this wider hip i don't know if it makes my hips look any wider i'm a stick like everything just goes straight down for me so maybe those will make me look better um but i got three pairs of them and i'm very proud of myself and i kind of want to trim up the hem 
on the darker blue ones and like see how that looks and maybe for summer I might trim up that one to make it just into like shorts for my swimsuit but anyway I was so proud of finding those like oh my gosh they're so cute and you can find those kinds like all throughout the thrift store that I go to Desert Industries we call it the eye here in Rexburg but um and they also have like a ton of American Eagle stuff if you like American Eagle which obviously I do and they have like Aeropostale um Hollister and they have like even more vintage jeans um but they have every kind of size that you could ever imagine and it was super exciting to find those and i'm really excited to try them on and then i'm like i don't know my style of clothing is very interesting sometimes i feel like i'm very different when i wear clothes but i found so i got this shirt this is actually a shirt from target it's the knox knox rose but I kind of, I kind of, I kind of, I kind of liked the color and kind of like how cute it was. It's more of like a baby doll shirt. And then these buttons are like little flowers. You can't see that from that far. They're like little flowers. And I thought it was pretty cute. And it's definitely got like the cute little baby doll sleeves here. Um, but I thought it was kind of adorable because I'm more of princess style, except now I'm getting like hipster mom style, I guess. I don't know. And then... <laughs> So I found this shirt and my sister and I started laughing so freaking hard and it's not anything I could ever wear out in public, but <laughs> wait, <laughs> okay, <laughs> if, if you know me personally, you know that I would never wear fabric that was as small as this um but my husband might like it so I bought it more of a joke and it's it was only two dollars and I thought that was so freaking hilarious I was like no wonder it's two dollars there's not enough material to make it cost four and my sister and I were cracking up so much but um the total was thirty dollars and seventy four cents um and every item of clothing was everything was six dollars and under like nothing was over six dollars which i absolutely love there was like also a jewelry box that i was looking at but i've decided that i want to go more chic um my husband got me a vanity for valentine's day and it's going up in our bedroom and i'm so freaking excited so i want to have something a little more chic to put on my vanity for my jewelry but anyway that is my haul for um, going thrifting. Let me know if you guys like the thrifting videos. I love going thrifting and finding really cool finds. I like to do a lot of things like that. I've found a couple baskets that I've put, in, put up in my house um, that I wanna put flowers in, even though my cat kinda wants to eat the baskets, but that's not a big deal. But anyway, thanks guys so much for coming back and watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. I kinda hope that you liked the different ness of it compared to all of my other videos that i've had um but i love you guys so much um my final request is that if you liked this video please give it a thumbs up and if you want to see uh, all my videos and any of my future videos please subscribe and then hit the bell notification to get notified every time i upload and i really appreciate you guys coming and watching it really makes me feel better about myself because it kind of takes me a little while to um make and upload these videos but i really appreciate it anyway have a great rest of your day and i will see you guys in the next one bye guys